Hi, my name is Jackie Bledsoe. I'm the author of the Seven Rings of Marriage book and Bible study. I'm a speaker and I'm the co-host of the How We Built This and Stayed Happily Married podcast. Today's verse of the day comes from Proverbs chapter 16, verse 9, and it reads, The mind of a person plans his way, but the Lord directs his steps. So I have to admit, this verse didn't always set well with me. As a planner and a visionary, I'm a person who likes to see their plans executed from A to Z, exactly how they laid them out. Um, and in my immaturity, I view this verse as saying, it doesn't matter what you plan. God's going to direct you and take, the step, take you the route he wants to go anyway. I was immature and discouraged by it. Um, and then I had a different perspective as I was um, going through our garage, cleaning some things out and discovered or came across our boys' old elementary school projects. And so, you know how those parents, you know how those projects go. Um, they are elementary. They get them from their teacher. They bring it home and it becomes a family fair to complete. <laughs> we did the projects. But what would happen is they would have in their mind, they would plan out exactly what they wanted to do. I want my castle to look like this and have this tower or a drawbridge or a moat. I want my villa to look like this and do this, my science project to have this explosion or whatever. Uh, but we knew that they couldn't take the steps necessary to complete the project that they had in their mind. So we had to come alongside and help. Much like we did with our kids, God does that with our plans. He gives us the free will to create our own plans, but he also takes the liberty and directs our steps so those plans line up with his will. And so those plans are actually executed and completed. So I wanna encourage you today, don't stop planning. Don't stop creating in your mind and visualizing what you want for your life, your career, and your family but marry your plans with the will of God. Lean in to his plan and His, and allow him to direct your steps so that way what you create is beautiful. What you create actually gets done and what you create gives him the glory. So I encourage you today, keep planning and keep allowing God to direct your steps.